than a month after being reported missing, Brianna Winston's family has the answer to what happened to her. In an argument, she had confronted him after learning about his infidelity. He choked her. Clayton County Police Lieutenant Ashanti Marbury says the hands around Winston's neck belong to Mikhail Edwards. He cleaned out their College Park apartment, but that's not where the story ends. Edwards is accused of zipping Winston's body up in a suitcase and jumping into his newly wedded wife's car to get rid of Winston's body in Tennessee. He then met with the man who police say has immunity, and the details get more gruesome from there. Together, the two men placed the suitcase inside of a burn barrel. They doused it with accelerant, lit a fire, and they kept that fire burning from the early afternoon until nightfall. Leaving only a skeleton in her belongings that they buried in multiple places. The story doesn't end there. Police say Mikhail took some of Brianna's remains and dumped them on the side of the highway. He then took the rest of her remains in the burn barrel and dumped them in a cemetery behind a church in Tennessee. His wife of only three months, Brianna Phillips Edwards, allegedly knew what Mikhail had done and provided him with the car to get to Tennessee. Several other of Mikhail's family members were also charged with their involvement in tampering with evidence after Mikhail was caught on a jail call to his new bride, telling her, his mother, and his brother to destroy certain items connected to the case. So essentially, this was a deadly family affair where everyone participated in the murder and cover-up of Brianna Winston.